right now, before we talk about this next story, let's check on that package again. See me rolling. Take a look at this. Speaking of boxes, Lauren Boebert's ex called the cops after a physical fight in public on Saturday night. What am I talking about? Well, turns out they went to dinner together. They've already been kind of having a little argument here. They're divorced. She was caught, if you remember, the Congressman Lauren Boebert kind of jerking it at the theater, uh, getting groped, and then trying to get that Boebert yogurt. Well, this was actually fantastic. She's back in the news once again. Unbelievable. As Lauren Boebert described it, the aide said, she tried again to keep him back and in the process, put her hand in his face. She says she did not punch him in the nose, but the ex-husband disagrees. Jason Boebert is a victim of domestic violence. He was popped in the nose twice by Lauren Boebert. The police came, but they arrested no one, adding that a friend drove Boebert home and that she and her husband are both completely safe. What do you think about that, folks? Now, if a woman's throwing hands and a guy gets popped in the nose twice, this is something we can work out. Put the police, they can just say, hey guys, calm down, clearer heads prevail. But I challenge any man out there to be very careful because if you're trying to block and you whack the nose just one time, just one fingernail scratches the skin, the cops do not have any leniency for you. Two-tiered justice system. Women want equal rights until the police arrive. Keep that quote in your back pocket. Hey, we hope you enjoyed that short clip. Now, click subscribe and click on the bell so you get all the notifications.